All right, this is a game I call Castle Smashers. Uh, I begin by telling the students who are marked by the stars that the half court line, that the half court line here, this half court line is the moat, okay, and it separates the two castle uh, kingdoms. Each one of these is a tower. This is a tower, okay, of marked by the castles. These mats here, these mats here are told to be the castles. They're mats uh, setting on end. Now, the job of each student, or in this case, um, catapults, their job is to throw the ball or the gator, the gator ball at one of the towers. Now, in the story, I tell them that the ball is a boulder. So if we put in a boulder here, So let's say that this is a boulder, okay, or in any type of ball that you would want. The student's job here, okay, the student's job here, this catapult's job is to take this boulder and take this boulder and try to throw the ball and knock down one of their castles or their castle towers. And so they would take this boulder and they would have to try and throw it at one of these castles and knock it down and the game keeps going until each side's castles have been knocked off the mat or in this case the castle. Um, some variations you could um, if you want to incorporate a mallet or of some sort you can have a student here let's say or in this case a catapult have a mallet and they can be a castle guard and their job is to try and knock one of the boulders away so if there were to be another boulder being thrown and we'll drag this guy in here maybe this is another boulder okay and the boulder and this boulder is being thrown is being thrown at one of the castle towers if this was going to be going at one of the castle towers here okay the student highlighted there could probably have a mallet and they could knock that away with a rubber mallet and things and so forth and the game keeps going as I said until all the towers are knocked over and it's a game I call castle smashers I actually play this game uh, with K to five students some things to be aware of is obviously trying to keep the cones from knocking off the mats and things like that. And again, watching kids watching out for each other and uh, not throwing the ball at one another. Uh, more information on this game will be on my blog. Thank you.